Good evening, everyone. I'm Zach Wheeler. And I'm Jordan Norcus. Thank you for joining us for 18 News at 11. From your local election headquarters, all eyes are on Iowa tonight for the first in the nation Iowa caucuses, where we are still waiting results. That's right. The state party says it is going quality control checks to make sure that the numbers are accurate. Democratic hopefuls hoping tonight's decision will give them much needed momentum going forward. Sarah Dollop is in Des Moines, Iowa, with the latest on that. Decision night in Iowa. Voters at 1,600 sites across the state made their choice at indoor sports facilities, community centers, Warren's crowd right here, and gymnasiums. Selecting from a crowded pool of candidates who've spent weeks and months crisscrossing the state, all trying to prove they've got what it takes to Iowa and the nation. We're kind of like a yard sign for the rest of the country. When they see who can win here, it may increase folks' chances of voting for that candidate on Super Tuesday. Senators who've been pulling double duty in D.C. with the impeachment trial returning to thank supporters. Others campaigning until the last minute, hoping to keep their message and momentum strong from Iowa on to New Hampshire. In Des Moines, Sarah Dolliff. NBC News. Now we will continue to follow the results. So for the late and for the latest election news, head over to our website, mytwintiers.com, then click on your local election headquarters.